On a farm just north of St. Joe, you can often find Zale Bledsoe out on the porch playing his guitar. I think each guitar has kind of its own personality. He should know because he builds them. I've been building stuff like kind of my whole life. A skill he inherited from his father who had a saddle shop just down the road. I remember going over there as a kid and oh, him always being down with letting me kind of build whatever I wanted. A little over a year ago, Bledsoe put his hobby to work. My main goal is that they make noise and that they stay in tune. And while playing in his band, Desodine, he loves the feedback from fans, especially when they notice. They ask you about it. They're like, what's up with this? Like, and then you can kind of pick the skateboarders out from the non-skaters because like, they're like, oh, yeah, OK. Like, yeah, I, I get that. The instrument in his hands was once under his feet. And I was just like, man, I play guitar and like I, I skateboard. Like I should probably build a skateboard guitar. For almost two years, Bloodso has been making guitars out of skateboards. Everything that I build with is uh, recycled, so somebody has skated it. I don't think that it, it would hold the same meaning if you just yanked 10 boards off the wall and just built a guitar out of it. So far, he's built about a dozen in his spare time. At his shop, Skateboard Everything in downtown St. Joe, the walls are filled with boards, parts, records, and of course, guitars. They each have their own little qualities that I like, you know? Skateboarding takes me, like, lets me hang out with my friends and get away from adult life sometimes. And then the guitar building is just a, as, as loud as it is in the shop, like when the saws are going and everything, it's like a peaceful time to sit and build. For Bledsoe, finding a way to combine his two loves just made sense. It would be nice um, to wake up in the morning and just build guitars. And that's exactly what he's doing. Patrick Fazio, 41 Action News.